hey, I'm really happy with the way this little uh, Collins double bit hatchet project is turning out. And I wanted to show you something that you've probably never seen before that I, uh, I did with the handle. And that is, instead of using some sort of a traditional wood product, like maybe a beeswax product or a linseed oil or something like that, I used this uh, old can of Red Wing leather conditioner. Now, to show you how old this leather conditioner is, there's no skew anywhere on this can. So that tells you that it's pretty old. And then also there are no list of ingredients anywhere on this can. So those are two indicators that uh, it's a pretty old product. But what I did, this is just to show you the difference, this is the color that it was. This isn't hickory, this is uh, hemlock. But they were very similar in color, so I just wanted to put this there to, to show you the difference. And what I did was I just rubbed that grease, that shoe grease, all over this handle really good. And then I heated it up with my uh, propane torch until I could just barely handle it. I mean, it was so hot I could barely touch it. And then I just worked that grease, just really rubbed and worked that grease into that handle. You know, heating it up is what really opened up the grain of this hickory to receive that, uh, that grease. And, of course, it kind of turned the grease into an oil so it would penetrate a little better. And just rubbed it in and rubbed it in. And um, it turned out really nice. Looks really good. I may even do a couple more. I might do that a couple more times before I finish hanging this head. I've just started setting, you know, measuring my wedge and, and that kind of stuff. So I may actually do another application of the shoe grease before I hang the head. And I'm really contemplating whether I should go ahead and paint the little, the orange stripe on this head as well. Traditionally, these Collins axes, um, I've showed you before, there's some orange on it, orange paint still left on it. They had just a, an orange stripe, about like that. And um, I'm trying to find out if they painted part of the handle, like if they painted the handle maybe down to here with the orange stripe or not. So, having a little bit of a hard time researching that. But um, anyway, I thought I'd show you guys the progress and show you uh, something different.